Ukraine breaks Russia's main defensive line with armor as forces make critical advances. Two minutes read. Ukrainian armor has broken through Russia's main defensive line in the southeast for the first time and is making major advances toward the town of Verbov, a sign the counteroffensive is continuing t. O pick up the pace and could soon reach a breakthrough. Ukraine's infantry made it past the main layer of defenses in the below are your comments. I don't understand why the A-10s aren't flying bleep up defenses positions and the tanks air power s. Ewer would speed things up. Don't look now, but Ukraine is winning. If they know what's good for them, the orcs will just leave. They shall win because they want to save their nation, and they will do this by fighting for themselves. Vase. If they have the F-16s, the advance would even be faster. Good news. Putin must be defeated. Pray for Ukraine. Next news. The U.S. is sending tactical ballistic missiles to Ukraine. Three minutes read. Officials confirmed the United States will provide Ukraine with the Army Tactical Missile System. MGM-148 TACMS. Below are your comments. This is the best investment in combat in U.S. history. 300,000 dead and maimed for life Russian soldiers versus zero NATO troopers. For only 5% of what the U.S. spends on defense in only one year, the U.S. has enabled Ukraine to literal Lee destroy half the Russian army. Now add to that major ships, Submer. ATA CMS or Bad Jose's accurate within one yard of the target. What happened now? We are not afraid of global nuclear war anymore. It's about flipping time. Dot. Next news. White House letter sets out reforms that Ukraine needs to implement to receive aid. One minute read. Mike Pyle, the White House Deputy National Security Advisor for International Economics, has sent a letter to the donor coordination platform with a list of reforms that Ukraine must implement in order to continue receiving military assistance. Below are your comments. Maybe this should have been done $187 billion ago? Brandon found another Ukrainian prosecutor that needs firing. Even the National Anti-Corruption Bureau is corrupt. The U.S. oligarchs are greasing up Ukraine to stick it in. The cons in Ukraine are going to be so mad, it's going to take more time to steal us tax dollars. Next news. U.S. sanctions Chinese, Russian companies over Ukraine war technology. One minute read. The U.S. Sanctioned several Chinese and Russian companies on Monday for allegedly supplying a blacklisted Rus. Sean firm with parts to make drones for Moscow's war effort in Ukraine. The Commerce Department announced sanctions against 28 entities in total, nine of which were implica. Ted in the effort to sell parts to the blacklisted Special Technology Center. Below are your comments. Our actions send a clear message to those trying to evade our export controls that there will be co. 
N sequences for behavior that seeks to undermine U.S. national security interests. After the 200 second time, they don't care because export controls are ineffective. For a country that is claims freedom, soon it is easier to track who the U.S. is not sanctioning. As if they care. Next news. Hungary's Orban threatens to pull support for Ukraine. Two minutes read. Hungarian Prime Minister Viktor Orban on Monday threatened to withdraw support for Ukraine in its war. R against Russia over concerns about the treatment of ethnic Hungarians. Orban told lawmakers in parliament that he was protesting a 2017 law in Ukraine that limits ethnic H. Hungarians from speaking their own language, particularly in schools and said Hungary. Below are your comments. And if, at some future date, Hungary is the next target of invasion, who will stand up for them? The Russian and the Mi First Republicans may applaud his appeasement but the rest of us know that it is wrong. Since they are against both, Hungary should leave EU and NATO. Russia calling its markers. Gangsters and autocrats never stop. Hungary under Orban is trying, like the US, and a few other places, to bleep democracy. NATO supports democracy and if the Orban government does not, they do not belong there or in the EU. Dot let them become a Russian fiefdom as they we. Hungary campaigning for more charity from EU. Next news. U.S. offers Poland rare loan of $2 billion to modernize its military. Two minutes read. The Biden administration announced Monday that it is offering a $2 billion loan to Poland, which has been a hub for weapons going into Ukraine, to support the Allies' defense modernization. The State Department said in a statement that Poland is a stalwart ally of the U.S. whose security is vital to the collective defense of NATO's eastern flank, and that such funding is reserved for Washington's most important security partners. The U.S. government is also providing Warsaw up to $60 milli. Below are your comments. Do any countries in Europe pay for their own defense? I realize Poland has spent the 4% they committed to, the rest of them, even in crisis do not live you. P to their commitments. $2 billion will not buy much at today's prices. Vote all of them out of office, start new with real Americans for Americans. Dot 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 dot. Billion here, trillion there. Every day Biden is writing checks we can't cash. And as those checks are cashed during the next administration, if it's Republican, the left will blah. Me them for the spending. Unbelievable. That money should come from EU not from USA. Next news. M1 Abrams tanks have arrived in Ukraine. Eight minutes read. Some of the 31 promised M1A1 Abrams tanks have been delivered to Ukraine and will soon join the count. Tear offensive. Below are your comments. Abrams tank is nice addition but the offense still needs air support. 
No NATO tank has bleeped more Russian tanks than the Abrams. No American soldier has ever lost their life in combat in an Abrams tank. Many, many Russian tankers have wished, if only for an instant, that the same could be said of any R. Russian tank currently in combat. They could be useful, but until mines are removed they will not be in heavy use. Of course, they are vulnerable to drones, anti-tank weapons, and artillery like everything else. The Challenger that was destroyed was first disabled by a mine. The crew cleared out but the Challenger was a sitting. It's only a matter of time before the Russian Nazi propaganda channels and trolls claim that Russi a has destroyed over 62 Abrams tanks. That counteroffensive had better get itself sorted out soon as winter is coming and at that point it all devolves into throwing stuff at each other from far away. Next news. UN says Russian troops torturing Ukrainians to death, reveals one survivor suffered shocks for, and eat. RNITY. Two minutes read. A commission ordered by the UN is detailing what it says is continued evidence that Russian troops are committing war crimes in Ukr. Anya. Below are your comments. And yet the totally ineffective United Nations does nothing to stop the Russians. They even allow Russia to be a part of their organization and have equal voting rights. What a sad travesty. Dot. Spend a few minutes in the library studying the history of Russia. This shouldn't come as a surprise. If Russia will send their own wounded soldiers to the front to fight. How angry and out of control is the entire army? So how could anyone not believe this is happening to civilians? Russian soldiers are being forced to fight against their own will, and are watching their brother's eye. N arms get SLA. Russia has shown that they still cling to medieval ways, and have not progressed towards civility or humanity. Putin is a leader that is devoid of any conscience or sympathy for others. Next news. Orban once again threatens Ukraine over rights of Hungarian minority. Two minutes read. Viktor Orban, the Prime Minister of Hungary, has announced that Budapest will not support Ukraine's NATO membership until the rights of the Hungarians of Zakarpasha, Transcarpathia, in Ukraine are restored. Below are your comments. Well let us see if he is in office a couple of years from now. He may not be in any position to object once Ukraine is invited into EU, NATO. Get this Magyar neo-fascist swine out of NATO. Budapest looks after their needs first. Refreshing to be smart. He's more desperate the Uke's advance makes him aggressive. Easier for NATO to eject this Putler-loving Muppet. Next news. First U.S. made Abrams tanks arrive in Ukraine months ahead of schedule. Two minutes read. The first U.S. M1 Abrams tanks have arrived in Ukraine in time to assist with the country's ongoing counter-offensive. E, the country announced Monday. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. 
I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace be. E4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. Former Lviv defense plant manager suspected of stealing gold and silver from air defense systems 2 meters. In read. The former manager of a defense plant in Lviv is suspected of appropriating gold, silver and other M. Edels from air defense systems that had been sent to the plant for repair. Source. Press Service of the Economic Security Bureau of Ukraine. Press Service of the Security Service of Ukraine. Press Service of the Office of the Prosecutor General Details. The Security Service of Ukraine reported that the suspect is the former head of a strategic enterprise, say in Ukraine's defense industry. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace be. E4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. UN rights experts decry war crimes by Russia in Ukraine and look into genocide allegations. 2 minutes re. Add. Independent UN-backed human rights experts said Monday they have turned up continued evidence of W. A. R. crimes committed by Russian forces in their war against Ukraine, including torture. Some of it with such brutality that it led to death and bleep of women aged up to 83 years old. Members of the UN Independent Commission of Inquiry on Ukraine also expressed concerns about allegations of genocide b. why Russian forces, and said they're looking into them. The team said its evidence showed Cree. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace be. E4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. Green a hard no on two spending bills after McCarthy flips on Ukraine aid. Two minutes read. Marjorie Taylor Green. Arga said Sunday she is a hard no on two spending bills after Speaker Kevin McCarthy. R. Califf said Ukraine aid would be included in the legislation despite opposition from the Georgia Republican. Dot. McCarthy said Saturday that he will keep Ukraine aid in the Pentagon funding bill, a reversal from H. His announcement a day earlier. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? 
Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace be. E4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. UK intelligence. Russian counterattacks to deter Ukraine's armed forces ill-conceived and unsuccessful. One minute read. UK defense intelligence has said that the Russian occupying forces are carrying out unsuccessful lock. Al counterattacks to deter the offensive of the armed forces of Ukraine. Source. European Pravda. Citing UK Ministry of Defense Intelligence Review on 25 September details the intel. Ligence says that the Russian occupiers are trying to hold back Ukrainian forces both on the Orokhiv and Bakhmut fronts, making significant efforts at the same time. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace be. E4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. Ukraine's own gas sufficient to get through winter for first time. One minute read. For the first time ever, Ukraine will have enough of its own gas for the upcoming heating season. Source. Ukrainian state-run national oil and gas company Naftogas quote. I want to remind you that we are increasing the volume of production of our own gas, and these Figor S are rising. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace be. E4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. Zelensky confirms first Abrams tanks already in Ukraine. One minute read. President Volodymyr Zelensky confirmed on Sept. 25 that the first U.S.-made Abrams tanks had arrived in Ukraine, without mentioning how many of the 31 tanks pledged had been delivered. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace be. E4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. Zelensky unlikely to send Reznikov to London as ambassador. Two minutes read. Alexei Reznikov, Ukraine's former Minister of Defense, is unlikely to be appointed its ambassador I. N. the UK. 
Source. Journalists of Ukrainska Pravda Roman Kravitz and Roman Romaniak with reference to their sources in the up to podcast details. The journalists report that the UK embassy did not receive any official request from Ukraine concern. Ing appointing Reznikov as an ambassador. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace be. E4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. Duda. Poland could send Ukraine older weapons after replacing them with modern arms two minutes red. Polish President Andrzej Duda sees no problem in providing Ukraine with older weapons from Poland's arsenal after they are replaced by modern arms, he said in an interview with Super Express on Sept. 25. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace be. E4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. U.S. Ukraine sign memorandum on strengthening Ukrainian energy system. Two minutes read. Subject to the availability of funds, the U.S. plans to supply Ukraine with $522 million in energy related assistance, including $100 million Pravi. Dead on the condition Kyiv makes progress in some energy sector reforms. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace be. E4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. First Abrams tanks are already in Ukraine. Zelensky. Two minutes read. Sources in the U.S. Department of Defense have reported that the first U.S. Abrams tanks have already been delivered to Ukraine, several months earlier than initial estimates. Source. New York Times, citing two unnamed U.S. Defense Department officials, as reported by European Pravda. Zelensky on Telegram details. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky later confirmed that the tanks were already in Ukraine. Abrams. Tanks. Are already in Ukraine and are coming to reinforce our brigades. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? 
It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace b. e4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. Military. 34 Russian Black Sea Fleet officers, including commander, bleep in Sevastopol strike. One minute read. Last week's strike against the Russian Black Sea Fleet headquarters in Sevastopol bleep 34 Russian O. Ficers, including the fleet's commander, and injured 105 more soldiers, the Special Operations Fork's command of Ukraine's armed forces said on Sept. 25. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace b. e4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. Missile wreckage reportedly found in breakaway Transnistria after Russian attack on Ukraine. Two minutes are. EAD. Oleg Belyakov, co-chairman of the Joint Control Commission from the unrecognized state of Transnistria. IA, has reported that part of a missile crashed in the village of Chitkani in the breakaway area of. Moldova following a Russian missile attack on Ukraine's Odessa Oblast. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace b. e4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. Special Operations Forces reveal Russian losses following destruction of Minsk landing ship and Black KC Fleet HQ. One minute read. The Special Operations Forces of the Armed Forces of Ukraine have reported that 34 Russian officers were bleep in the attack on the headquarters of Russia's Black Sea Fleet in occupied Sevastopol. Source. Press Office of the Special Operations Forces. SOF. Quote. Updated information on enemy losses as a result of the SOF's special operation to destroy the Minsk. Landing ship and the headquarters of the Black Sea Fleet of the Russian Federation. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace b. e4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Next news. Russia's Black Sea Fleet commander among 34 bleep in a missile strike in Crimea, Ukraine claims 5 miles. N. Reid. 
The missile strike that blasted the Crimean headquarters of Russia's navy last week bleeped 34 officer s, including the fleet commander, Ukraine said Monday, though it provided no evidence to support its claim. Ukraine's special operation forces said on the Telegram messaging app that its strike on the main BU Ilding of the Black Sea Fleet headquarters in the port city of Sevastopol had wounded 105 people. The claims could not independently be verified and are vastly different from what Russia ha. Below are your comments. As long as they don't drive them into minefields, everything will be fine. I thought Russia claimed they already destroyed one? Russian propaganda maybe? Months ahead of schedule. Dot why doesn't that surprise me? It's a fool's errand to prop up Ukraine. We should stop throwing money away and help them steer the conflict towards negotiations and peace b. e4 it's too late and there is no more Ukraine. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.